Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to our YouTube channel. This is John from Samax Code. And in this video guys, I'm going to show you how to load another FXML uh, on the same window or the same scene. So basically guys, what we have here is we have two FXML, the FXML document one. So we have here the button. So if we try to click on this particular button, it should be or it should load another FXML into this anchor pane. And the second FXML looks like this. Okay. So we have also the controller of our document one or FXML uh, document one right here. And then we have the method load second that is connected to our button, uh, the button right here. Okay. So we have the on action. And then uh, it is calling the load second method or function. So now what we have or what we will try to do is load this XM, uh, FXML2 into our FXML document 1. So in order for us to do that, let's just copy the um, mechanism of loading the document 1. So because document 1 is the default FXML file loaded when our application starts okay so we'll just have to copy this and back to our um, document controller and then okay so instead of using parent we're going to we're going to use the anchor pane and then it should be pane right there and anchor pane fxml loader that load get class get resource and instead of document one we're trying to load the document 2 okay so fxml document 2 that fxml and then of course we have here the root pane so that's basically what we have here anchor pane and then we have the id root pane so that will be for us to use that particular object root pane and then get children and then set all and then we're just going to use the pane which will contain the fxml document 2 okay so i think that's about it and let's try to run our program just so you can see that it is switching between two fxml file okay so click on the load second button and there you go it is loading the second fxml document so i think that's all there is to it for this video guys and i am inviting you to subscribe to our youtube channel samax code for more cool videos about programming javafx uh, php and more so thanks and see you in the next video